Do you guys remember when all the little kids used to perform and sing? I was one of those little girls performing, and it's great to be a headliner on a Saturday evening. New Mexico loved Ernestine Romero. That was her talking to the crowd during a performance in Las Vegas just a couple of years ago. But today, tragedy. She and her husband were found gunned down inside a car outside the state capitol. Good evening. I'm Steve Solis. So many of you have weighed in on social media to remember Ernestine Romero. Even in our newsroom, some referred to her as New Mexico Selena. Now Patrick Kane spent today in Santa Fe joins us live now. Patrick, so many are struggling to process this. Steve, this is a very heartbreaking situation and not a lot of details are being released right now because this is an ongoing investigation. But like you said, a lot of people are at a loss for words. Ernestine Romero and her husband, Jesse Salcedo, were both in their 30s and both were found dead in this white BMW parked in downtown Santa Fe. Investigators say the couple died from gunshot wounds, but officials tell us there's no suspect or shooter at large. So we asked if this was a murder-suicide. We're trying to confirm everything at this point to confirm that or say anything else would be compromising the scene for the detectives or investigators. Family members didn't want to go on camera, but a fellow musician and friend of Romero's tells us he didn't believe the news. Complete shock, uh, utter disbelief. Mark Ortiz says he met Romero in 2006 when he was doing sound for a concert. She was pure fireworks on stage. I mean, Selena was her biggest influence. Beautiful voice, her stage presence was amazing, her dancing. Yeah, she was, she's gonna be missed. Romero was also a state employee with the Public Education Department. Earlier tonight, the governor did send a statement calling this a horrific tragedy. Of course, we'll keep you posted on air and online as soon as any new details become available. Reporting live in Santa Fe, Patrick Hayes, KOB4. Patrick, thank you. We spoke with one of Ernestine's friends from childhood tonight, living in Farmington, and she shared her, shared her favorite song, which she shared on Facebook Live just a couple of days ago. This year was in Las Vegas, New Mexico, in their 4th of July celebration. Artisine Romero was a well-decorated performer and was indeed based out of Santa Fe. She actually released nine albums, many available on Spotify or iTunes. And according to her website, she actually released her very first one at age 11. She said her father influenced her and that she also loved Selena. And as you can see, she's performed all over the place. In fact, she just sang less than two weeks ago at the San Ignacio Church Fiesta in Albuquerque.